although like for solo queues things that would translate over would be map awareness and things like that um not so much like how a team fight is exactly going to go down because you don't have everyone coordinating on that Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and that does that does not mean we give up. It's, it's, we can still win this fight. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, solo leaners. Um, <laughs> Rexar is one that I'll pull occasionally. Um, Zol and Zagara are probably my top three. I would say. Um, I can pull Blaze. He's decent. I can pull Artanis. Sonya is actually up there above Artanis. Um, but I I prefer. I would say I actually prefer range. Um, I like when I like I said I've been, or I haven't said, but I've played since beta, so I played when Sylvanas was like really good, and you could just solo push all the way through. So that was like my first like love for this game was like Sylvanas just solo pushing all the way to a keep, and then you just drop to a different lane and do the same thing. Um, but. Um, I would say that you'd have four people go mid, one person go top as alter spawn. Um, I would send two bot and then have the solo lane and the other two from mid rotate in for the top objective. Um, so you have two people zoning, one person tapping, uh, and then you'd have one person zoning and one person tapping down at the bottom. Um, you want to get camps as they come up. Um, you want to go for your camps as first. If you're noticing your other team is behind on rotations or stuff, you might want to try and steal their camp. Bot lane is the most important. So after the first set of objectives or the second set of objectives, you want to try and do a push bot as hard as you can um, and basically maintain that lane as it goes. Well, the other thing is, that's a lot of death. <laughs> is yep. I think I'm dead, yep. I overextended, I didn't expect it. Yeah. Uh, Dahaka should probably be bot, and but I'm gonna let him go top. I'll go bot, soak that. Um, the new character is pretty good at teleporting in and out. He does most of his damage by range.
Uh, best to get camps. Until I have swipes, probably you. Um, as soon as I have my increased attack speed as I swipe, then I would say that you, I probably have the best at camping. Um, and uh, I would say that Kerrigan's not able to solo lane until 4 because... Cleave. You can dodge everything. It's how fast you can take it without taking damage. Silva's bot, getting pressure. I now have cooldowns. Root on Golden. I do, so you go ahead and tap and I'll zone. Well done. Think I'm dead here though. Do you want more? The Lord will not keep me. Nope, I got away. Yeah. Thank you. Kerrigan stalled enough for us to get our tower shots. Uh, from here, I would say you need someone uh, still in the top lane, um, and you need one person in mid, but I'd say the three bot is probably the best. Um, and continue to put pressure in, and push that. Um, <laughs> Are you homebound? We can take their camp. I am too far forward. Uh, not now. This is their tool. Yeah, I overstepped my overstayed my welcome there. Uh, I would say that we probably need top camp taken, um, and just to distract them and make them go up there so they don't have to, they're looking somewhere else on the mini-map. Um, there were two top now, so I would say that there's three missing. They're probably grabbing their camp now, which they were, and now they're probably rotating to take mid-altar, because that's going to be the closest one to them. Belong to those who claim them. Tapping bot. I have no one covering for me though, so Sylvanas is gonna poke. The top needs to stay. Here comes Sylv again. And there's a couple of them down here. Tool on me. I'm dead, but I have a root on him. We have an incoming flank from behind. No, they got interrupted. I have skeletal mages for zoning potential. I'm going to go ahead and head top, take that camp since they're all bot right now. Um, you probably want to head down there, help them, and then immediately go and take camp after it's capped. Oh, 
They've already killed. There's two dead. I would say you could probably go ahead and just take camp. Dahaka is going to help me take this top, and then I'm going to rotate mid for soak. That's fun. Keep it up. The top needs this way. Uh, help Kerrigan continue to push bot. The more pressure you put down there, the better. They're dealing with top right now. There are four missing. They're uh, not baiting. I guess baiting boss would be the best way to put it. They're not engaging on it. You are in trouble, my friend. Back up. I'm taking their siege camp. If you want to help, that would be wonderful. They're going to be heading top for that boss. I would say push this hard end through and then rotate up there. Provide protection. And then now rotate up for boss to make sure that they're not actually taking it. They're all split right now, so there was two there. They're not actually on camp. Do have a gold down in the KT up here. They're engaging on that. They're busy with the tower, so we have fight potential here. Goldan is out of position. We're all split right now. We need to group. Uh, just let one of them tap and just kind of zone. Got a kill here. Go ahead and push. Uh, take boss now. We have lead. Uh, they have VP, so be wary of that. I would say push bot out or top out, sorry. Uh, then clear mid. Um, we have level lead right now. There's no need to waste it or do anything stupid with it. We only have a Rex that's out position. We could probably gank him. Kill the bear. He's dead. He has nothing better to do. Continue to push top. As soon as we get this down or at least do some damage, rotate down to do our camp. Kerrigan's in trouble right now. And she's dead. They're rotating up on us, time to pull out. Uh, we want to stop them from taking our keep, or this, but they're going to do it anyway. It's okay, happens. We're gonna have to deal with this. Uh, we have to deal with this. You you probably want to do that. Um, they're trying to take altar. It's okay to let altar go. We have such a large lead. Yeah, and then we shoot the other ones. I'm rotating down. I think he's dead, though. Uh, not really. We're just kind of going to zone them out, make sure that they stop chasing. We don't want this fight. We're a man down. We just kind of... There's a zero tool up here. I guess we're fighting this now. It's not the best thing to call, but it's something. Yeah, 
You should be able to get a kill then. One for one again. You're gonna wanna pull out now, take their camp. Kerrigan's going for top altar, so one person should probably go there and help them. Um, one person needs to take altar. Yeah, they're taking one, one. They're still down one right now. They're gonna have five though. We're all even. Let's feel free to fight. If we can get together, um, clear mid and then push for their camp. Um, because if we can get control bot lane, that's going to be the best outcome for us. There was almost a kill there. Was a kill. All right, now we take their camp. We have a lead. There's no reason not to. There is a Goldan, or was. They just took camp. Rexar. And we just lost Kerrigan. Um, yeah. I'm just going to clear bot. Watch out, be careful, they might be coming up behind you. Clearing this, we should be able to burn this down. There is only one left right now, and boss is coming up in 45 seconds, so let's grab top camp, or our camp, bot. So they're looking at that, and then we'll take boss again. VP saved us, right? All right. Uh, we can do boss now, but it's better just to take their altar since they're down one. We can posture around it. The altars stand ready. Capture them before the Raven Lord's pawns do. We're just stalling right now. Sahaka just died. Tapping theirs. That's the game if we take it. Or boss. Doesn't matter. And that's game. GG. Okay. Um, is it nine? Nope. Yeah, if you double tap nine, you can see everything that I've watched. Just have a plan.
Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, up until recently, Hotswog said that I was plat slash diamond, so I'm not quite sure what changed there, but it did. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Gotcha. The battle begins in ten seconds. Three, one, strike swiftly. Okay. Where exactly are you looking at right now? Or are you just kind of looking at mid? No, I... Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you're saying just do what the objective is for that map. Yeah.
considering it's level six now, I'd probably say kills over camps. Um, because at this point in the game, at level six, uh, minion waves, one kill is, is more experience than a minion wave. So by getting a camp and having it push, you're not getting as much value as you would be if you were getting a kill at that point. Um, so in order, like I was saying, grab camps, push through, bot, and just kind of continue pressure there, um, which inevitably makes the team rotate down there, which will make them fight you. But if you were just to get kills along the way, it would boost your experience lead more and faster. Okay. Mm hmm Okay. Okay. Yes. So in this instance, you'd have Dahaka top, supposedly, maybe overextending a little bit, baiting them to come for him, and you'd have uh, Kerrigan and Bala sitting in a bush waiting for them, and he'd pull back, and then they could gank. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Counting? Oh, yeah. Mini map awareness. Yeah. Yes. Correct. Yes. As of right now, no. At the time, yes, because I did see two to three, or is it two of them that were mid, I think, 10 seconds ago? So I was just looking at the mini map, I saw that they backed up. Hmm. Okay. No, you you back you you back up at full HP because you don't want to overextend, and then you go for a camp afterwards, which is what they were doing. Take the camp, so we go running into a team. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're going to camp. Well, the close. Yeah, the close. And if we disappear, then they're going for the camp. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> yeah, 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 because it just came straight down instead of, and because we were going up towards camp instead of going down, it was an easier gank. Got it.
<laughs> but I, I want the thing. Okay. Yeah. Um, if you have the lead on a two altar phase, or if you don't have the lead, I would say prioritize one um, and send one person to poke at the other. As long as they're not... I mean, the best person on their team to poke would either be the Gul'dan or the KT. On our team was either the um, Mephisto because he has his teleport ability or you um, and then send the other three to go or four to go and secure one of the points. And then as soon as your point is secure, then you rotate down to the next one um, as, as the other four approach, then the fifth person can join them and you try and take over that second one. Um, well, if you're completely falling apart, then you try and, I mean, before or after you got one of the altars. If you get neither of the altars, I would say um, one. Oh, okay. It's all good. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then what's the next best play? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. You're, you're you're basically a, a massive wish list. And anytime something happens or doesn't happen, you add or remove something from that wish list. Yeah.
mate, you miss stuff sometimes, or you miss gauge spirit health. Right? That's how it goes. Uh, from here, you see that there's two top with the Dahaka currently trying to solo both of them, which is one, a bad idea. Uh, yeah, yeah, very, very ill-advised. Um, you have two of us mid. Um, I, uh, looks like you're headed bot to help out the Kerrigan, which I'm assuming is going to mount and clear that wave. Um, knowing that, I would say that the two of us mid would clear and then rotate up to help the Dahaka. Um, as he pulls the what assumes to be the bear down to us, um, trying to pull out of that engagement because you don't want to be with a stun lock with a KT because that's a bad idea. Um, yes. Um, but. Slight. Okay. Yep, there's three missing. Mm -hmm. Lane clearing. So you could leave him mid. Poke and hard engage. I think. Yeah, I, he's a damage. He's a damage dealer. Yeah. Uh. Range damage as well, poking. Mm, depending on how she builds, she could go W or auto attack, which would do it, yeah. Ganking. Um, she can wave clear if she takes the right talent at four, which she did not, so she doesn't have cleave. So right now she's full uh, dive, which is... Um, she's a dive person, essentially. Uh, solo laning and getting out of sticky situations. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I said help. I wouldn't say gank. I was I was more assuming help. I I I guess, but the 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 idea that I had in my head was pull him out of the situation, not help him fight it. I was saying deter off the the Rexar and then just move back to our side of the map. Um, the XP atop, yes. Fights are going your favor. Your game because you have the advantage in health and damage. Uh, do you have a camp pushing bot or about to be? So I'd send all five top, push them out of top, and take boss. Um, looking at camp timings, thirteen seconds on theirs, two minutes on ours, two eighteen. Um, leave Zol there, have Vala come up and Kerrigan come up and bait their camp. Wait for them to come on it. As soon as Zol finishes clearing, go down and help. As soon as it's baited or they've started it, you can jump on them getting a kill and securing their camp. Uh, to be honest, I don't see a third or a fourth. I mean, they're there, but I'm not... Correct. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not so good. Mm 
Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, I guess the one question that I would have had is right there, um, like after seeing it play out, Mephisto did actually go up and try and help Tahaka, who ended up dying. And I came down and helped push. So essentially we did half and half. Um, we succeeded at one and a half of the plan and failed at the other half because we tried to save Dahaka and, and then two people died. Um, yeah. Yeah. So I guess I, yeah. Um, so I guess my, my response to that question or that answer is a question of, so you said that Dahaka pushes, Vala pushes, and Zul push, but they all push in different manners. So would it be better to put them all each in separate lanes and have Mephisto and Kerrigan roam? Or would it be better to group all three of those together and push hard one lane? Um, I understand that's very... Mm -hmm. So run is five? Okay. You're there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I also just noticed that their Rexar hasn't picked two talents, which makes me assume it was a bot. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I 
I, I called for, uh, I think I called the camp down here at the bottom, and so you went to the faster route where I was gonna go down and around. This is where I was saying, go help the Dahaka, but don't engage. That didn't happen at all. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, so it's... At just our view or at everything? Okay. Um... So my call was going down to save the Dahaka. We made it out. We would have been late if he was going to die anyway, so we shouldn't have been there. We should have probably been... Well, both lanes are pushed up, so we probably should have been rotating down to at least try and defend that uh, wall. Um, yeah, well... Um... They're starting to pull out, so like I said, there's no need to chase. Um, looking at everything, you see Rexar is going top, so that means it's a 4v4, essentially. Um, so we could take that fight, um, but Rexar is also close enough to turn around and join the fight, turning it into their favor. Um, we're not going to have uh, minion support, and they will sooner than we will, because they're running back to their side of the lane. Um, their camp just came up, so they have that advantage. If they team wipe ups, they can take that camp push hard with Sylv. Um, we just had a camp taken. So... Yes. Yes. Can Kerrigan kill that Golden? Yes. Yes. I would say no to that because she has a teleport and she has um, a gravity lapse sitting in the way along with the like there's characters to get through to get to her. But the gold and yes, she. Which turned. Mm, almost all up. Well. They have horrify, which means you're not going to get gold in. And they have VP to save him. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They're at half health, and we're not. Mm hmm. Uh, actually, I would call to go in because you have two forms of CP. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, two ETs is a lot. A lot. Uh, I would say no. Just just go back and, and hold the wall. Um, yeah. Mm-hmm.
-hmm. Yeah. Unless you're playing Brawl, and then... Yeah, you both, you both went down, yeah. Yeah. Not just what I'm... Yeah. Yeah. And then again... <laughs> now, why did you take Strafe here over Reign of Vengeance? Okay. Okay. Yeah. There's, yeah, collapse and kill. Fair enough. Uh, no, that's about all that I had. Um, other than like, can you send me the link and stuff for the video? All right, thank you, man. I really appreciate it.